This is exciting. We've got the wonderful Damir, who was one of our earliest members to join the Sales Confidence membership and has basically helped us build this membership that, that we've developed over the last year and we continue to grow together. So Tamir, thanks for doing this and sharing your experience. Uh, can you just introduce yourself, your role in the company that you work for, just to set the scene, please? Yeah, absolutely. Thank you for having me, James, in the membership and today on this talk. I'm Tamea Idlasri. I'm an account executive and I work at a company for Breadwinner for about two and a half years now, I think. Time is flying. Amazing. And um, what was the original reasons why you decided to join the Sales Confidence membership? So actually, and James, you seem to clearly be very good at this. You read my mind when you had reached out to me because I was in a bit of a holding pattern in my career, or at least that's how I felt that I wanted to develop myself and I wanted to start doing more. I was like performing well, everything was going fine, but I thought, I know there's more I can do here. And I just didn't know where to start. And that's where you reached out to me and said, we're going to start this membership and it's all about self-development. I was like, this is perfect. So that was literally why, because that was the one thing I really needed to work on was self-development. So it was perfect timing. Amazing. What was your world before sales confidence versus what it's become since you've become part of the sales confidence membership? Yeah. So again, like I said, before I was like performing well, I was doing okay, but I was very much in my own ways and just staying there, not really moving forward anywhere. Part of that was because I work for a small startup. So there's not as much opportunity to build a uh, kind of sufficient mentorships internally. So that was pre sales confidence membership. And now one of the biggest values of the sales confidence membership has been uh, the ability to network with a ton of like-minded people in a little bit earlier in their career or people later down the line of their career and just having that ability to identify mentors and, and learn from people outside of kind of the small company of where I work. And that's been really good. It's really opened my eyes to a lot of different things. That's fantastic. And what would you say is, what's your favorite part or your favorite experience of being part of the Sales Confidence Membership? So I'm going to sound like a broken record here, but it's connecting with people. It's just invaluable. I think working in sales is absolutely invaluable to build a solid network. And it's not just a network of people that you can potentially sell to in the future. That's a given. But it's the people that are within your community that have the same experiences day in and day out or previously had an experience that you're having now that can guide you to how you can take specific paths in this career. So definitely the, the networking aspect has been invaluable. That's great. Yeah, I think having access to that wider group of people that you can pull on for advice and guidance is superb. What's the feeling of being part of something like Sales Confidence? Can you articulate that maybe? You put me on the spot there because I was thinking about this and it's really, it really is like being part of a community. Uh, I think that's the only way that I can describe it. It just feels really good to have access to a very large and consistently growing group of people that are ultimately in the same boat. Realistically, we're all in the same boat, regardless of where we are in our career, we still have those same experiences. So it just feels less lonely. I never feel like I'm alone. If I ever feel that, oh, I'm having a tough month, I don't know who to look to. That's just not a case anymore because I know that I can reach out to any of the members, whether they're a mentor, whether they're a peer, whether it's yourself, James, then I know that I have people that I can go to, which is massively helpful. That's great. Is there like a, a value that you can attribute or like an ROI um, on what you've put into the, the membership and how's that been returned to you? Absolutely. I would say the number one value that I've had from the membership is the gaining of confidence, both in professionally and in my life. And when I say confidence, I don't just mean like confidence in myself and my abilities, but just the confidence that anything that I have control over, I can make it work. Um, and before I was really struggling with battling myself, imposter syndrome, I think is a massive topic across the membership community and we all experience it. And for me, that used to be absolutely terrible. I used to think things that had about 0% possibility of happening that will happen. 
that's what I used to tell myself. And that has massively changed, which has just positively reflected on like my entire career, uh, my day to day and my life as well. Just having that positive mindset. Thank you for sharing. That's really that's part of a motivation for me. And I don't often hear those stories. So I really appreciate you sharing on the impact side of things. So that's cool. Really cool, actually. Is there something like unexpected that like you just discovered by being part of the membership that you just thought, well, this was, I never thought I was going to get access to this or see this or hear that or meet this, like something unexpected. I think the biggest uh, kind of shock for me was the openness of everyone that's involved with the membership. And again, the openness regarding things that we don't always talk about, right? Like the mental struggles that we go through as salespeople, again, burnout, imposter syndrome, stress levels. It was really, it sounds a bit morbid, but it's nice to hear that other people are experiencing the same because again, it can feel really isolating if you feel like you're the only person. So the fact that, and obviously salespeople, we tend to always put on this front, like everything is fine. We're doing really well. Everything's good. Whereas in the membership, you feel like, in there's a level of trust that you can share absolutely anything about how you feel and there will be somebody else that has either felt the same or is feeling the same and the fact that everybody is so open I think that was the biggest shock because I thought we tend to put on a mask every single day for our clients a lot of the time and I maybe I think I expected the same to start with the self-confidence membership as well but actually it was the complete opposite and everybody is very open that's great to hear. Really great to hear. And you may have already mentioned this, but just to put this in before our kind of penultimate question here, is there kind of something specific like a win or success or outcome that you can link back to what you've learned from the membership? It's a good question because I think there definitely there there are multiple wins and it's difficult to pinpoint because rather than them being small physical wins I just feel like it turned around a lot of aspects in my career that I'm just generally approaching things differently I'm performing better every single call that I go into thanks to a lot of the things I've learned uh, from the membership I'm going into them with a different mindset a different approach so there's an infinite amount of small wins rather than so far rather than one kind of big win but right. that I'm still working towards so I'm sure yeah. it'll come I love that that's great and so final question if someone's listening to this and they're on the fence they're, they're not so sure about joining the sales confidence membership what, what, what would you say to that person get off the fence and go for it <laughs> as there's nothing to lose and there is a ton to gain that's all I would say amazing uh to me yeah, thank you for sharing i really appreciate it and also just thanks for being such an early adopter i'm a big fan of yours i said that from the moment we we spoke and feel free to reach out anytime enjoy the rest of the summer and i look forward to catching up with you soon thank you james always a pleasure take care speak soon take care